In this video, we are discussing about the projection of solids with the condition axis perpendicular to HP and parallel to VP. As an example, we are taking a pentagonal prism resting on the ground with its base and one of the base is parallel to VP. Since the prism is resting with its base, the axis is perpendicular to HP and parallel to VP. The base of the solid is prominently seen in the plan. So we should draw the plan first, that itself. One edge of the plan should be parallel to XY line. Draw an XY line first. Draw one side of the pentagon parallel to XY line. Draw 72 degree lines on both the sides. Draw arcs from the end points of these lines. The intersection point of this arc should be joined with the end points of various lines. Thus the plan is completed. Mame the corners of the pentagon. Now to draw the elevation, Project all the corners of the plan above the XY line. Mainly in the height of the prism and elevation. Darken all the visible lines in the elevation. Invisible lines or invisible edges should be drawn as dotted lines and show some dimensions. In another example, we will take an hexagonal prism resting on the ground with its base and one of the base edges perpendicular to VP. Since the base edge is perpendicular to VP, one side of the hexagon and the plan must be perpendicular to the XY line. Draw the XY line first. Draw a circle with the side of the hexagon as radius. Draw a vertical center line for the circle. Draw us on the circles from the end points of the axis. Join these points to complete the accident. Name the corners of the hexagon with numbers. Now to draw the elevation, project all the corners of the plan to the XY line. Mainly the height of the prism and the XY in the elevation, above the XY line. Darken the visible lines. Show the damage. In the third example, a square pyramid is resting on the ground with its base and two of its base edges are equally inclined to VP. Two edges of the square of the plan should be equally inclined to XY line. So draw the XY line first. Draw one side of the square with 40 degree inclined to XY line. Draw other two sides perpendicular to the first side. Join the endpoints to complete the square. Join the diagonals because the slammed edges of the pyramid are visible in the plan. Name the corners with numbers. Name the apex point also. Project the apex point and made it the height of the pyramid in the elevation that is about XY line. Project the base corners kill the XY line. Darken all the visible slant edges. Name the corners of the elevation. Show the dimensions. In the fourth example, a cone is resting with its base on the ground. Plan of the cone can be seen as a circle. Since a cone does not have any base interest or base commerce, it will not be having any further subconditions. Do I make XY line first? Draw a circle below the XY line. Protect the center of the circle above the XY line and maintain the height of the cone in the elevation. Project the left and right quadrant points of the circle up to the XY line. Go and darken these points to the apex point 
These lines are called generators of the cone. Show the dimensions.